I'm here with David, and David, introduce yourself. We're at Castle Hill Terraces, the art and architecture event, and you're one of the local artists that we're helping here. Um, talk, tell everybody about yourself. I'm um, David, and I'm a local artist here with uh, Angela's group with the, um, the Castle Hill project thing. Uh -huh. And um, I've got stuff I've been doing in my neighborhood and well, play now. Talk, what's the best painting you have here? Best one is that one. All right. Cool. And my friend Rachel. Your friend Rachel, okay. And uh, it has a, a moment to it. It was an odd moment, and it, it stayed kind of like a moment. So it's awesome. what, what's your mode and medium? Like, what is that on, on what? It's oil paint on masonite. The thing that makes okay. clipboards out of paper okay. sand makes art boards out of it. Okay. And, um, and it's oil paint that's so thinned out that it acts like watercolor. Okay. Let me look at some of the other stuff you got here. That's a little local coffee shop on Mary Street called Cafe Caffeine. I've actually been there. It's a little fish bowl deal. <laughs> that's, uh, that's awesome. He's talking about that right there. That's a. Uh, Downtown, my friend Chris and I uh, paint downtown a lot together. Okay. He has an identical painting that's his version of this thing. Okay. Um, that's my old hippie roommate. Okay. Um, those are both ex-girlfriends. Uh -huh. And this is across the street from where I live right now in, uh, in East Austin. So what inspires you? There's anything in the world. Like, there's nothing that you can't paint. If you can't get inspiration from um, anything, then you're missing out on painting. Oh, okay. So if you look anywhere long enough, it suddenly becomes mesmerizing because the way the world is shaped is very strange and wonderful. Which uh, architects have to know that because they're shaping space and making little deals. So your guy here, he he saw what was what you can see downtown, what you can see around with the trees and the live oaks and all that, and uh, and wrapped this around it. They did that there. I I love that too. What do you like best about Castle Hill? Uh. uh up high and all the levels you can stand on and see the down low and the big live oak tree that they left without yeah it up. keeping it green they recycle them most everything here <laughs> david i really appreciate everything here uh, how does someone reach you if uh, they want one of your paintings uh david or uh angela who's uh, runs these things here always knows how to get well she has a bunch of my paintings too so. okay thanks a lot